Jewelry Harvests Human Energy A conceptual collection of jewelry designed for different parts of the human body harvests energy from the body's natural functions. What if you could wear a smartwatch powered by the kinetic energy of your movements or lead jewels that glow on contact with the warmth of your skin? It's not that far-fetched, after all we already have kinetic analog watches, and a high school girl invented a thermoelectric torch last year. Jerusalem-based artist and designer Naomi Kisner has designed a series of body jewelry called Energy Addicts that is designed to tap into the energy our bodies generate on a daily basis, but not in the way you might think. I have chosen for my devices to be invasive mainly because I wanted to shock people a bit, she told Knet. The piercing of the body supports, I think, the idea of an addiction. The conceptual collection of gold and beer polymer consists of three pieces, each of which bears the skin e-pulse conductor, blood bridge, and blinker. Each is also designed to collect energy in a different way. The e-pulse conductor is worn on the back, directly over the spine, where it would collect and store energy sent from the brain's electrical signals down the spinal column. Blood bridge pierces a vein into places as the blood flows through the chamber. It turns a wheel inside to create kinetic energy. Finally, Blinker sits on the bridge of the nose, arching out over the eyelids, collecting energy from voluntary or involuntary blinking. They don't, of course, actually work. Kisner said they are more intended to convey what could be. The collection is mostly speculative, but in the foreign scenario we, our bodies, will be able to power everything, she said. The devices are meant for harvesting the energy, and then through designated ports we will be able to transfer the energy and power up any device we want. If her collection, or something like it, were to become real, it would join refined ship in the adamium magnet in plants as a possible means of technologically upgrading humans. I think that anything is possible. And it was my main goal to imagine possible future, but I think that if we will start harvesting energy from our bodies, probably the next stage will be to modify our bodies, Kisner said.